Hi everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel or wel well, welcome back to my YouTube channel or I would say welcome to my YouTube channel if you're new here. So if you're new here, hi, my name is Jennifer. I'm 20 years old. I post makeup videos three times a week if I can and if I'm not, if I cannot, I will always update you guys on Instagram. As always, if you're not new or if you're new, my Instagram is always in the down bar. My username is always in the down bar. There's lots of a couple of facts about me. And for today's video, I want to be doing the one dip challenge. So I've heard about, I've heard like Kathleen Lights do it. And I've seen a couple of other people that did it on YouTube. So yeah, and it sounds like really fun. So let me read you guys. Let me just tell you guys what are the, the, the rules. So I'm going to show you guys an example with, let's say, I don't know, let's do, I don't know, what I'm going to try. I want to show you guys something, show you guys a makeup product, and then I'll be able to show you guys what we have to do with that product. So, there, and I'm finding brushes everywhere. So let's say we have, uh, let's say a lip gloss, or a liquid lipstick, yeah. This is a Essence Matte Up Liquid Lipstick. You're allowed, whatever comes out of the tube, you're allowed to apply. You cannot double dip. So it will go for all products that we're going to be using today, especially even eyeshadows. So let's say I get my big fluffy brush. I grab just a random palette. I dip in one shade, and that shade I cannot double dip. If I would have to dip into, let's say, I'm going to go one, one crease shade, and I need enough, enough, another crease shade for this side, I'm going to have to do one side, one side, which I probably will end up doing. I'll probably do like one eye, one color, one eye, the other color. We'll see how this challenge goes, but we do have to follow the rules, and it's the same thing with skincare. Let's say this, my, my booster. This, all this product I have is the one I have to use. I cannot use more than that, or then you get disqualified. So yeah, okay, so before we get started, please subscribe down below to get notification, turn on your notification bells so you guys will be updated when I post all my videos. So I'm pre-record, I'm not pre-recording, I have the whole month of November planned out and all that, so there will be videos, and if there's not, as I said before, it will be get to update. So before, let's get into the video. Okay, so... Happy Monday, first of all. How are you guys doing? That's I should have started by saying that, but I'm so excited to be able to film this challenge. I've been waiting to do it. Okay, so we're going to start off by applying our hydro, like our NACY2 Pollution Booster from 111 Skin. I have. I just want to let you guys know that before you do any sign of makeup or skincare, well, I washed my face and I washed my hands. Especially with COVID and all that, you have to be extra safe. So I'm taking all of what I have on my finger. And all this will be used on our face. I like to rub up. Not down. Up. And I'm already running out. Which is really bad. Do I have like a drop more? Yes, I do. I have a had like a drop more. I do not have the the bottle. The bottle the dropper is here. The bottle is here. So we have we moisturize. Now I want to apply a little bit of eye cream, and with the eye cream, it's going to be easy. Dunk, dunk like you know a little bit, and apply on the both eyes without going to the dunk back. This is really good for under my eyes. That's what I like to use to counter, to just to, you know, counteract the blues under your eyes, the purples and blues. So now we're going to use a concealer to prime our eyelids, and we're going to use the same concealer to use on the rest of our face. You guys are lucky. I have so many concealers. My sponges, you know, they don't, they're not 100% wet, but it will get the job done. You come back here. So I'm using Dose of Colors in the shade 08, which is light. I am only using this on to... And all that I have on the, on the, on the Dose of Applicator is what I'm going to use on my eyes. 
and I will be able to dip it back into the pot until it'll be used as, as concealer. And this is all the concealer I'm going to use to kind of, you know, to prime the lids. So there won't be any other concealer used. That's why I decided to use quite a lot because, you know, if I can get like really good eyelid coverage, then it's spot on. Okay, so I don't know how we're going to do powder. I'm going to use my Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder. I do, look, one dip, tap off the excess, uh -oh. and, and set the, the eyes in place, which is really good because, yeah, okay. So now what we're going to do is we're going to do our eyeshadow. I'm going to dabble into a bunch of palettes today. Till I get the desired look I want. But I really want to start by putting on a vase. And that I like to use my Ha 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 from my Alamara Spanglish palette. Which is my one of my most pigmented eyeshadows. So I'm going to go with Ha Ha Ha. Once I leave the pan, is I have enough. So I swirled my brush. So I've seen Kathleen do it. And she... And... It makes you really see. So I'm just using the same product. I just like warmed up my brush because that's sometimes what it really helps if I warm up my brush. If I did want to go back in with this shade, I would have to use it on a different brush. Which I don't have time for that today. So next up, I'm going to take a different brush. I'm going to take one of my Luxie brushes, which is my heavy-duty brushes that I love so much. And I'm going to use uh, my Beauty Bakery Breakfast in Bed eyeshadow palette. You guys see me use it for all the time. I'm going to be using my Alamar mirror. Just a mirror. Not any of that shade. I'm going to go in the shade... Messy hair, swirling my brush in it, tapping off the excess of, of course, and I'm gonna start applying that on in my crease. Well, the eyeshadow is looking pretty, you know, pretty matte. I want to take a different brush again. Not, not you. I need a, I need a sh packer, like a shader brush. That's what I need. So I'm using the Luxie 209 large shader brush. I'm going to go in the shade it's called French Doors. This shade is perfect for the inner corners. And I still have some left over for the brow bone. Not much, but it, it's still something. So now we're going to go in with this, the same brush and we're going to grab Fresh Face, which is a shimmer. I'm really, you know, swirling my brush in there just to get like enough color. Like, you know, enough color. Enough color, and if I can't, well. I went into another shade. I went back into French doors. The two mixed together are so beautiful. Okay, look, it's not, it's not perfect. So I just took another shade, uh, you know, I'm trying to perform it, you know, a little bit better. I used a little bit of Cuddle Cakes, 
which I don't really like that shade, but you know, I had to get something shimmery onto my eyelids. And yeah, I want to use something else on my brow bone because I didn't get enough product on the brow bone. So I'm going to take my Philip Orange palette and I'm going to use this shade as my highlighter shade. And I can also use the white as like a brow bone setter. And also if I want to add some, you know, whiteness. So yeah, this is basically our eyes. I am not in the mood to put mascara at all right now. It's like really, like it's not late. It's almost four, it's almost five o'clock. And yeah, I'm starting to get tired and well, I'm not starting to get tired. Just, you know, we have, I have stuff to do later on. So yeah, I'm probably gonna apply to maybe, maybe like a little bit of mascara. I wanna do my eyebrows really quick. And I will be using a brow powder to fill them in instead of using my brow pencil because I don't know how I'm going to do the challenge with just a brow pencil. So I'm grabbing my Lexi, my Lexi 201 brow and lash brush. Put up my brow, my, my, my brush up my hairs. And then I'm going to grab my uh, brow pencil. I'm trying to look for like a brow pencil. Okay, well this is a Morphe, it's a Morphe liner brush, but since I don't use liner. This is as good as it gets because I only get one dip. Okay, but now we're going to use my clear brow gel. So what I'm, we're going to do about, like, you know, brow products or mascaras. Rub. Rub the product. Oof, just gooped out a lot. And we're going to set those brows. Next step, concealer under our eyes. Let's see. I have to shake my concealer. I always like to shake. Dipped up my product. Not, not scraping off because that's when we're going to lose product. Grab. I have to dip back. It really makes us think that we do use a lot of product. And we don't have to. And I'm just gonna blend out a concealer like so, like that. Like that. You could. Oh, I love this concealer. And if I do want to add more concealer, I have a bunch of other concealers that I can use. As um, I don't want to use foundation today, so I'm going to use concealer as foundation. And what is the perfect concealer to use? That's my lip balm. That's my concealer. Now yeah, I'll use a little bit of foundation. So all that I have on the wand, because my pump is broken, all that I have on the wand is what we're using. This is the Revlon Color Stay. So and this is all I pumped out. So this is all the concealer, um, all the foundation we're gonna use on my entire face, which is really good because this con this foundation is pretty full coverage. This is the normal to dry skin one. Which, just with like a little bit, it does go such a long way. But I love a lot of coverage. I don't know why, but I definitely do love a lot of coverage. 
because I like, you know, I liked all my redness to be counteract. But like, this would be an amazing challenge, like, for everybody to do. Just to see how much makeup we are wasting. But you know, like, dipping our brush in products like 15,000 times while we're doing our makeup. Like, of course, you're gonna see some stuff like YouTubers and all that, they have plenty of makeup. I I don't have plenty of makeup, okay? I just have enough makeup for myself. Okay. And yeah, I love makeup. Like I love everything makeup related. But would I like, you know, spend fifteen to sixteen hundred on makeup? Like I'm not bashing on anybody. But yeah. You know, if you want to buy fifteen, sixteen, seventeen hundred dollars worth of makeup, go for it, girl. You know, live your life. Taking a little bit of, a little bit of two face concealer, just because I need a little bit more, you know, coverage. And it is lighter, which is really good. I love when it's like a little bit lighter. Okay, so now we're gonna set our face. Taking brush. Dip. Dip. And set. Face is completely set. And only one dip. Great. Now we're going to take my random contour powder. Like we normally do. Really swirl. Tap. I just swirled off some powder on the cover. And now double dip. If you double dip, you're out. Now we're gonna use Ace Beauty Bronze in Paradise, shade number one, swirl, oh, it lift, tap, look, really tap it off, guys. Or another way to tap it off is, you know, it's just to, this way you're just using this to bronze, like, not to, not to contour it. I want to apply, I don't want to apply mascara, so I will probably not apply mascara. So, all we got to do are lips. I don't want to put mascara, I know, I, you know, I'm bashing this. So, I'm using my Hard Candy Plumping Lip Gloss as my lip color. Hope I forgot how much I love this lip gloss. So this is the final look. I know it doesn't really, you know, seem a pleasing or like, you know, the best look. But, you know, it's a really, it's a warm eye. But yeah, it's a challenge to do. I recommend all of you guys to do this challenge. And if you do, post a pic on Instagram. Don't forget to tag me. My, As you guys know, my Instagram is linked in the, disc, in the down bar. So yeah, that's basically it. I cannot wait to talk to you guys again. Can't wait to see you guys in my next video. Next video will be going up on Wednesday, which I will be talking a little. I've already done this video. I looked at back at the footage a couple of, month, couple of weeks ago, a couple of months ago. I was like, okay, no. Let's like take it off. So I'm going to be talking to you guys a little bit more about my life, personal in-depth in my life, and what kind of goals and what kind of plans do I have for the next 10 to 15 years. If it's not YouTube, if it's like personal, if it's like, you know, that kind of, those kind of categories. So yeah, guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please subscribe down below, turn on your notification bell so you guys will be notified whenever I post. 
leave a comment down below and see what kind of challenge you guys want to see even though i've already planned out my full month of november but if you have like a really specific challenge or really specific look using any of the palettes that i showed up today leave a comment down below and yeah guys i have a question for you guys also today besides what kind of videos you guys want to see what uh, what is your favorite makeup product of the moment? You have a brand, a product, a certain like product. It could be concealer, it could be foundation. What product do you love recently? I have been loving lip gloss like this, lip balm like my Sol de Hereno, Hanero. And also I've been loving like no makeup makeup, which I do sometimes. I go out bare face. A little bit of mascara, something in my brows, and a lip color. Some people put concealer, but I'm like, okay, I don't have time to put concealer. I just put lip gloss, lip, uh, mascara, and brows. That's that's usually all I do. But so, what is your favorite category or brand or product that you guys have been liking lately? I really cannot wait to hear you guys more about this. And also, I want to give. I already did a give shout out in my last video, but. I want to give a shout out to my friend, Jennifer. I even know you're probably going to see this after your birthday. I'm sorry, but I love you. I cannot wait to see you again. I know I said so, I said that in my last video, but I cannot wait to see you again. I miss you so, so much. I can't wait. Okay, so that's it for me. This was Jen. I cannot wait to see you guys in my next video. Bye.